guys, today we're going to learn how to fill and use blood bags for a Halloween party like I did at my vampire dinner party. Let's go. That's right, we're going to have wine and a blood bag. These are so fun. These are food grade blood bags. I just got these on Amazon, but they have them in a lot of different party stores and Halloween stores. It comes with a syringe as well as your blood labels. And then you can choose, you know, O neg, A, A, B, whatever you want. And it also comes with a spill proof clip. These are really cool. So you can actually set this down and it does not spill a drop. Just going to take one of my blood labels right off and then stick it on. And then make, this is much easier to do before it's full. And then what are we feeling? I'm thinking AB neg. All right, put our label on. There we go. And then it's ready for the clip. So you just wanna kind of open it up a little bit here. See that? So that you can stick the straw through. And then how it works, is you clip it just like that and it pinches so that no liquid can get through and you can set it down. Pretty clever. We've got our blood bag ready. Just gonna open my wine. And you can of course use whatever red liquid that you want to fill this with. Kids would love drinking out of them just with whatever your favorite red juice is. The only thing is you don't wanna use anything carbonated because the syringe uh, loading process, filling process, does affect the carbonation, so keep that in mind. Now I was going to come up with some sort of cocktail for this, but when I have bolognese sauce, I really just want Cabernet Sauvignon. So I thought that's what we're gonna use because guess what? It's the perfect color for bed. So I'm just gonna take my syringe, insert it into the wine, slowly pull it back so that we fill it up all the way. I'm gonna insert the syringe into the tube and slowly fill up the bag. This takes about two syringes. It should be noted that before filming, I filled the bags with water using the provided syringe to rinse the insides. You can fill these with almost any red liquid, but avoid hot liquids. You also should not freeze these blood bags. Wine looks particularly great because it's more similar to the color of blood than a bright juice would be, but fill with whatever you like. There you go. Five cc's of Cabernet Sauvignon. Actually, this holds about five ounces, which just so happens to be a standard pour of wine. For more fabulous vampire dinner ideas, be sure to watch the vampire dinner episode of The Rose Table. You can get all of these vampire recipes and many more Halloween party ideas on therosetable.com. Comment and tell me what next year's Halloween party theme should be. And don't forget to check out my new fairy tale line on shoptherosetable.com. Thanks for watching.